Good morning. Welcome to Science 4 for Quarter 3, Week 1. Our learning competency, you are going to explain the effects of force when applied to an object. At the end of the lesson, you are expected to 1. Describe what happens to an object shape when force is applied. Number 2. Understand the changes happens to an object when force is applied. And the last one is explain the effects of force on the shape of an object. Before we proceed to our new lesson, let us have some mental exercises. Let's try this. Are you ready? Direction. Choose the letter of the best answer. Write the chosen letter on a separate sheet of paper. For question number one, blank is the applying of force to move something closer. Letter A, push. Letter B, pull. Letter C, a push and a pull. Letter D, all of the above. The correct answer is letter B, pull. Number 2. Blank is the force created when an object is physically pushed or pulled. Letter A, applied force. Letter B, friction. Letter C, gravity. Letter D, magnetism. The correct answer is letter A. Applied force. Number three question. Blank the act of applying force away. Letter A, pull. Letter B, push and pull. Letter C, push. Letter D, force. The correct answer is letter C, push. Number four, type of force when you open the door. Letter A, applied force. Letter B, friction. Letter C, gravity. And letter D, magnetism. The correct answer is letter A, applied force. For number 5 question, daily pre-applied force from the choices which do not belong. Letter A, friction. Letter B, pull. Letter C, push. Letter D, speed. The correct answer is Letter A, friction. Force has always been a part of our daily lives. It cannot be seen by our eyes, but we can feel the effect of force. Whether we are doing household activities, working in the field, or even playing, we can see the effect of force in action. Force is either 
push and pull of an object. It can be due to gravity, magnetism, friction, or anything that might cause an object to move. Now class, can you identify the kind of force that is exerted in the object? Is it push or pull? Let us answer. Correct! This is push. What about the second picture? Correct! This is pull. What about this picture? Yes, that is push. Push is a force that moves an object away from one another. It's a force that moves an object closer to another object. Now, what changes happen to an object if we apply force on it? Of course, the shape of an object may change when force is applied because force can change the shape of an object. Here are the examples of ways of changing the shape of an object. We have pushing, pulling, pounding, compressing, bending, twisting, tearing, stretching, or squeezing are some ways of changing the shape of an object. Class, you have to remember that force can change the shape of an object. Some objects return to their original shape after the release of force and some are not. The shape of an object may change when force is applied on it. Pushing, pounding, compressing, bending, twisting, stretching, and squeezing are some ways of changing the shape of an object. An object that will return to its original shape after force is applied is called elasticity. Class, are you ready for your learning task? Let's begin! <music> 